name is Suyun Park, and I think I was born curious. I am interested in mathematics, physics, and neuroscience. Winning the Brain Bee contest gave me the opportunity to work and study in Dr. Fang's lab at the Department of Physiology at the University of Toronto. And I was exposed to many things that I had not thought about before. My name is Nazrin, and I worked in the lab with Su Yoon. I'm a PhD student in the Department of Physiology at the University of Toronto. I'm fascinated by the brain. I think it's the most powerful organ in the human body. Yet there's still so much unknown about it, particularly in the field of neural regeneration. Our research looked at how exposure to hypoxia affects neurons in a freshwater snail. It was fascinating to me that we could apply this research to the human brain. The simplicity and unique qualities of the freshwater snail allows us to use them in a variety of studies. For example, unlike people, snails retain the ability for central neuron regeneration well into their adulthood. So if the central neuron of a snail gets injured, the neuron regenerates. In our lab, we're trying to understand some of the specific mechanisms of this regeneration. The brain is naturally protected by the skull, but a severe impact can cause damage to its delicate structure. For this reason, it's important to always keep the brain protected. For example, when riding a bicycle, it's important to wear a helmet. Neuroscience and regenerative medicine is a growing field. One day, we hope to understand how to regenerate central neurons in humans to help people who have had brain or spinal cord injuries. I will be attending MIT in September, and neuroscience research is one area I'll definitely consider in my future. I want to make a difference.